Hello, ladies and gentlemen, it's Mike here at Game From Scratch. If you are an Unreal, Godot, or Unity user looking for some 3D environments, boy, do I have you covered today, because there is a brand new Humble Bundle for all three of those engines, as well as five other bundles I have mentioned in previous videos. I will revisit them at the end of this video. So if you're looking for 3D environment assets, yeah, we've got you covered. So this is one of the assets. By the way, do not judge the performance of what you are seeing here. Uh, I've got a lot of different game engines open right now, as well as video recording software. So this isn't how it should be recording. This is how it records when you have Unity, Unreal, Godot, multiple instances of each open at the same time. So this is one of the assets. This is the Cathedral environment. Uh, this one is available for all three game managers. So you can see here it is running inside of uh, the Unreal Engine. And here we have it running inside of the Godot game engine. Now, obviously, you're going to notice very different lighting. And the other thing is Godot doesn't have native light shafts out of the box. So you're seeing here uh, no light there. But otherwise, you see it's it's static meshes with texture. So it's going to look pretty consistent across platforms. Uh, minus, again, the lighting setup are going to be completely different between each. I do love to see the fact that Lurtes is doing more and more uh, Unity assets along with their Unreal and uh Unreal and Unity. Sorry, <laughs> they're doing additional Godot stuff along with their Unreal and Unity stuff. So that is the one asset running in the two different versions. Now we've got another one here. So let's head on over. We'll check this one out in Unity first. So what you see here, this is a stylized cyberpunk city running inside of the Unity game engine. So everything you see here and going over and so on. So that is inside of Unity. So now we have the same exact same asset available and this is uh, inside of the Unreal Game Engine. Again, much more stylized, uh, just the, the lighting and shader effect that they're working with. And we'll do this in reverse. So we'll go back and go to where we started from on that one, which is over here. So you got a much more saturated texture style. Well, this one is not available for Godot per se. But the nice thing with Unreal Engine is you can easily get assets out into other game engines. And I used, in this case, the Unreal to Godot plugin. I'm going to a bunch of guides down below for how you can get it from one engine to the other. But here we see inside of the Godot game engine, the same environment. Again, uh, I have set the lighting up to try and sort of recreate the um, style that we've got from uh, the Unreal Engine, but getting lighting to match between different game engines is an absolute nightmare. But you can see this is exported using that particular plugin, so you're getting the animated textures and so on, like what you see there. And once again, uh, you can get it across, this guy's bike is not having a good day. Uh, you can get it across two other game engines and working pretty easily. That's the nice thing. Again, if it is available for Unreal, you can essentially get it out to any other engine you want if you're willing to jump through some hoops. And you might have some little things to fix. Like, for example, this texture is not right. So you potentially want to swap out the texture on that guy. But that's that's kind of it. It's, it's a pretty good export and can work across engines. So let's go ahead and take a look at the bundle itself. This is called the Big Bang Unreal and Unity Asset Packs Bundle. This is an exceptional deal on the level that you are getting 75 assets here for 20 bucks USD. Now, what you're getting them is for a variety of different engines. So this one you can see, for example, is Unreal only. This one here is Godot, Unity, and Unreal. This is the, the cathedral environment we saw earlier on. This one is uh, Godot, sorry, is Unity and Unreal Engine, uh, Unreal only, Unity, Unreal, and so on. I'll talk about how you redeem them in just a second. Uh, but yeah, you should go, um, again, available across a variety of different engines. There's not a ton of Godot-specific stuff here, but any of the Unreal Engine stuff can be exported over to Godot. So as long as you're willing to you know, go through that hoop. Now, the the minor stuff at the bottom, again, a ton more environments, and then we've got some, like, asset packs, etc. a couple of characters, but I think most people are definitely going to be here for the environments, and I've got, I'm a sucker for environments. I always love environments, personally, so, um, yeah, and you're going to notice these things marked, uh, first time on Humble, definitely something you want to be aware of, although they may have been available in other bundles. For example, this one, Pirate Tavern was given away by Epic Games at one point in time, uh, and then uh, there's one other bundle here. It's the, this one uh, was definitely in one. Of, I think one of the bundles I'm going to talk about later. So make sure you don't already own what you might be interested in. But truth of the matter is at 20 bucks, if there is a single environment here, it makes all the rest of it basically free for you. So that's that, that's a heck of a deal. So that, ladies and gentlemen, is the bundle. I'll show you how you redeem those things next. Now, when you go ahead and redeem this, the way it works is basically 
Uh, you've got a couple of assets that, strangely enough, redeem on Gumroad using particular code. Like, you've got three of these assets that are Gumroad. I don't know why you've got those three standalones. I have no idea why they did it that way. But the vast majority of them are available this way on their Cosmos store. Uh, so for the Unreal Engine one, you click it, and it will give you a key. It's ditto for the Unity one. This will redeem them on the Unity Asset Store. And I'll show you what is available on the Unity Asset Store. Now, the good thing is you can actually get these onto the Epic Marketplace, aka Fab, as well. And I will show you how that works as well. So basically, you get a product key. This one is for Cosmos. This one is for Unity Asset Store itself. So then once you've got your keys redeemed, by the way, they do expire, but quite a ways out. Uh, once you have them redeemed, so here you can see I've redeemed them on the uh, Unity Asset Store. And you're going to see basically everything from May the 30th. So right here up. So Carnival Environment, Stable, Chinese Alley, Pirate, Stylized, Sci-Fi, and so on. Everything you see here is available on the Unity Store. And everything else is available on Cosmos, including stuff for Unity. So the nice thing is you are getting a lot of these assets directly on the Unity Store as well. And then we come on over here. This is Cosmos. So this is uh, Lurtest Studios uh, storefront online. Uh, and yeah, so what you do, you come in here, uh, you go to your account, uh, sign in, and then you redeem, and you put your code in. And then you've got them. They come into your uh, your inventory. For example, here, this is the, um, the uh, cyberpunk stylized environment, for example, that we looked at. And this here is the ancient cathedral. And you're going to notice for each one of these, you drill into it, and you'll see the various different platforms that are available. So you've got the Unity version, the Godot version, and the Unreal Engine version all available for download. And then what you're going to notice here is when you want to go ahead and grab it, you head on over here. So I can say, okay, I want to get this for Godot. I want it to be for Godot 4.3, and I want it to be forward plus renderer. Or I come in here and say, I want Unity uh, 2023 and HDRP or Universal Render Pipeline or whatever, or once again, Unreal Engine. And then I pick the version of Unreal Engine I want it to be for, and then I download it. A lot of cases, this doesn't actually do anything. You get, like for this case, you get the same project if I pick this or this, as far as I can tell. Uh, but then you just open up the project file. Uh, in the case of Unity, it brings down a zipped Unity asset package, which you import into your project. And in the case of Godot, it brings down a zipped project file that you just open up in Godot, and you are off to the races. Now, another thing I want to point out to you here is this link over here. So you can get redeem codes for Unreal Engine Marketplace. You're going to have to do this one by one. But anything you've got on here that is also available on the Unreal Engine Marketplace, you can basically generate a code and then get it there as well. So if you want all of your stuff to be on one store, you can do that with this bundle. Uh, so that part is definitely nice with the way that they've handled things as well. Uh, and I did mention there are a couple of other bundles going on. I've covered these in previous uh, videos. I don't know how much longer these are going to last. But basically, there are the Space Nova bundles for Unity and Unreal Engine. So Space Nova bundle, you're seeing it's 15 assets, so 15 different packs. Uh, this is all different environments for Unity. Um, and then I don't know how much overlap you're going to have potentially with this bundle. There might be some. You're going to notice this price tag says $99.99. It's not. Use the code SN70. It knocks that down by 70 bucks. It becomes $39.99. Also, same time, there's the Star Nova uh, five-pack bundle. So you got five items in this bundle. Uh, so you can see there the Pirate Tavern. So there's definitely some overlap with these various different bundles. But again, it generally boils down to if there is one asset, it makes it all worthwhile. And in this case, it's showing that it's $49.99, but it's not. Use the code SN40. It brings it down by 40 bucks, and this becomes a $9.99 bundle. At the same time, there is one for Unreal Engine as well, 15 assets here. Uh, and then you use the code SN70. That brings it down to $39.99. Then we also have uh, the Star Nova bundle. This one again, SN40, brings us down to $9.99, and you're getting these five assets. And then finally, we have Star Nova for Godot. There's no uh, big, there's no 15 asset pack one for Godot, but there is this one. So this is Star Nova for Godot. Use the code uh, SN40 once again, and that drops it down from $49.99 to $9.99. So between these. I guess these five bundles you saw here, and then this one um, now on Humble, you could get a ton of assets, super cheap. So uh, I like Lortez stuff. Again, they represent a number of different people. Uh, I'm always curious what your opinion is. I, I know some people love it, some people hate it. Uh, again, I have a weak spot for 3D environments. This is like my, my personal hoarder kicks in for this. And the thing that I really love to see 
Is this available for multiple game engine stuff? If Cosmos keeps doing that, bravo. I love that store, and I'd love to see more and more people doing that and releasing it for multiple game engines like this. Eventually, we should start seeing that on Fab more too. So uh, that's a good thing. It leads to a better world, in my humble opinion. So ladies and gentlemen, that is it. The Big Bang, Unreal, and Unity, and Godot. I don't know why they didn't brand it that way. Asset Packs Bundle, let me know what you think. Once again, if you use any of my links, it does help support me. And again, remember, use the code SN70 or SN. 40 when checking out with those particular bundles uh and you'll knock a whole bunch off of those ones and then the humble one well it's normal just buy it from humble so let me know what you think comments down below i will talk to you all later goodbye